It supports 3D now. Oh, it does? Yeah. Stupid. Well, uh, yeah, your opinion on the rogues again, now yeah, that I've told rogues, you about... The rogues are fucking idiots. They suck. I fucking hate them. They control the powers of the universe <laughs> for absolutely no reason. They're well, blue-collar criminals. They fucking... You said they rob banks. And, and they steal they shit. They fuck shit up, and they ruin the Flash's day. Yeah, and they can... The one that has a gun, they can create absolute zero. Absolute zero. They control the, like, powers of the universe. They got temperature, they got sound, they got gravity. Uh, what what the fuck else do they need? Do they need to be... They control dimensions? Fucking mirrors and shit? What is that? Well, it's not really dimensions. He could just travel from one mirror to I'm another. Just, well, it's, Plus, there's the also... Al there's he's in the mirror dimension. Yeah, and then there's alternate realities within the mirror dimension that and he can travel I, to. I'm guessing... Well, they, they got, like, those... I don't know if it's the rogues or whatever, but the Flash has that guy that fucking... What's that? The... It controls time or whatever because he fucking runs fast on a treadmill. That's the Flash. The Flash himself has... I'm just saying, he's he has an item called time because he can run fast. Well, he can't like really, he could just run fast enough to power up his time machine called the time uh the uh, what was it called again? The cosmic treadmill. Yes. See treadmill. It's a literal treadmill that can travel yeah, through can time. Go, yes, you can run through fast. I understand. That's what I'm saying. The Flash and everybody in his comic books apparently just need to control every <laughs> power, governing power of the universe. This is ridiculous. And then there's the top who can who uh, when he spins around and shit, he gets smarter. And he has, like, telekinesis Does and he? Shit. He gets smarter because he spins around? <laughs> yes. Are you kidding me? I am not like, kidding. A, is, that, is he a supervillain? Yes, that's he's a supervillain. Super he's is a, a blue-collar super... criminal? He just robs banks and fucks No, he's a, he's a criminal mastermind or some shit. Ooh. And he's the top. Is he the top at the yeah, top? Yeah, he's like, he has a top that is an atomic grenade. That if the flash stops, if it stops spinning, it explodes and creates an atomic grenade. He's a fucking asshole. <laughs> it's the top. Everyone why does, agrees. Why does the flash have, like, the coolest villains... That are so useless. I don't understand this. Well, they're not really useless. I mean, uh, the, the trickster. He managed to fuck over Necron, who is, uh, the, who is the, uh, DC's version of, uh, the devil. Okay. He fucked okay. over the devil. Okay, what, what does this guy do? Necron. He's, yeah. he, he, like, trades souls and blah, blah, blah. He, he's, he's the devil. Shit. He's the devil of the DC universe. So, he, so, so he controls life and death? Yeah, pretty much. And the okay, trickster so fucked him over. Life and death. <laughs> they yeah. can't control it. It's just trickster trick. Okay. Trickster well, tricked him into not killing all the justice. Well, League. then you got that. You got time. You got temperature. You got sound. You got gravity. His villains <laughs> suck. <laughs> but they're awesome. This is bullshit. Lex Luthor, like in fucking Superman, he's a smart guy, and he fucks Superman's day up all the time. And he's a criminal mastermind. He doesn't even have any superpowers that I'm aware of at this point. He doesn't have any. He's exactly. dying of kryptonite poisoning in there some comics. But okay. Now, he's an awesome supervillain, but he doesn't have any superpowers. That's ridiculous. These guys get, like, magic shoes and shit that they build, because, <laughs> and they're not even in high school, because he's afraid of falling. But yeah. he can control <laughs> gravity. He, he doesn't, well, he doesn't necessarily control gravity or whatever. He just doesn't fall. Yeah, he can walk on air and shit. Yeah, he's an asshole. And then he uh, trick, and then he ma modifies toys and shit so they explode or whatever. Good for him. I'm sh I'm glad his uh, circus education is really <laughs> helping him out there. <laughs> and then Pied Piper, like I said, he can control sound and he has sonic guns. Oh, and and he knows the anti-life equation. Really? Yeah. So he, he, it so actually he somehow no, the anti-life equation just drives you insane oh, and so like can... lets you warp reality and shit. But the thing is, Piper doesn't know he knows it. I just said. Uh, the universe <laughs> just warps reality and he just has it. He but doesn't he, know he well, has it. Well, it got retconned so he doesn't have it anymore, but uh, he, he, did, he didn't even know he had it when he did or some shit. It was during some stupid event or whatever. The Flash villains make me angry. <laughs> but they're awesome. You like, should there's read. no fathoming. Uh, like, and then how there's, they oh, I didn't even told you about Captain Boomerang. Really? Guess it's, what his pal Guess what his thing is. Does he throw boomerangs? Yeah, exploding boomerangs, razor boomerangs. Oh, if, if they explode, do they still come back to them? <laughs> no. That would be ridiculous. <laughs> no, they just explode. And then there's razor boomerangs where you can, like, cut off your head and shit. And he's Australian. That's racist as fuck. <laughs> yeah, but also, Digger, he's such an asshole that even Australians don't like him. Like, explained in the comic, the most Australians actually hate his guts. <laughs> He's a walking stereotype. Oh, <laughs> yeah. He throws boomerangs around. That's and racism. he's an Australian. He's sexist, racist, and just a general racist goddamn asshole. Finest. There we go. <laughs> there we go. He's I'm, an asshole. I'm just done with the Flash for, for a while. I, I don't even want to talk about him. You should read the comics. The Flash is awesome.
Makes me so fucking pissed. And then he has a son who's part speedster, so he's got short bursts of super. He's of part su- speedster though. Yeah, he's so. uh yeah, he's a half speedster because uh, Boomer- Captain Boomerang, uh, George Harkness, who's nicknamed Digger for some reason. I don't even know how you get Digger out of George. Uh, traveled to the future. It's so obvious. I don't know what you're talking about. He ended up traveling to the future and uh, fucking uh, Bart Allen's mom, who's uh, who's Inertia slash Kid Flash. Obviously, because I mean. But yeah, he ended up fucking Digger. Ended up fucking Bart's mom, and that ended up with Owen, who uh, has short bursts of super speed. Like he can't go super speed all the time, but he has short bursts of it. I fucking hate the ropes. You should love I them. I fucking hate them. <laughs> the comics are really awesome, no, no, no. though. I fucking hate them. That's plain and simple. If I, I find one reason to like them, maybe I will enjoy reading the comic book. But for now, I fucking hate them. Do I need to find a rogue comic and make you read it? Maybe. Okay, I'm planning on buying some Flash comics anyway, so I'm going to make you read them. Good. Good. If there's one minute detail that makes me enjoy it slightly, the rogues, and they're not total fucking douchebags who control the powers of the universe, well, maybe I will um, enjoy uh, Mark is usually the weather wizard. He's usually off doing oh, his own shit. Oh, and weather! I totally forgot weather. <laughs> yeah, he's got a wand that lets him control the weather. Yes. Except right. in the new 52, he has the power... He still has weather powers, but they make him insanely depressed. Like, suicidally depressed every time he Why uses them. Why doesn't he just fucking kill himself then? Get rid of him. Good. I'm, I'm, I would oh, so and glad. he's a Guatemalan drug lord in the, in the reboot, for some reason. Again, racism at its finest. Yeah. So, still going strong. Still going strong, <laughs> Yeah, and strong, in the reboot, guys. instead of the name uh, Mark Martin, he's, he's Marco Martin. Whoa! <laughs> that blew my mind. I didn't even... I couldn't... Yeah, and uh, in the reboot, uh, Cold, instead of having a cold gun, he, uh, uh, that can cr- create Sub-Zero, he controls ice. He, he's a meta-human now. He can, like, create ice and, like, make the area Sub-Zero by leaching all the temperature out of it and shit. Fucking... <laughs> yeah, he became a metahuman somehow, in reasons that not explained. <laughs> so they just... They just bullshit through their, their way through the, his storyline, don't they? They just bullshit their way through it. Well, they... I mean, he's created, like, cold mirages and shit. I'm just talking about, like, anything to do with the Flash, apparently. Do they just bullshit their way through all of it? They just make shit up as they go along? Sometimes... I mean, back, back in the Silver Age... They made when Bart that's, with that's Barry DC Allen. In general. Yeah, I'm back in the Silver saying. Age during with Barry Allen, with Bart. Bleh, that's like with that Barry, Plastic Man and shit too, right? He's fucking Plastic Man who can stretch his body into different reshapes. That's what I'm saying yeah. though. Is like they, 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 he was in the Silver Age, right? Yeah, and it, during the Silver Age they tend to bullshit things. Yeah, they just bullshit their way through anything during the Silver Age. Yeah. Now they're just, now it's just a flash. He just they just bullshit a story. They're like what could we have? What can happen next? He could run really fast. Well, that, yep. I never thought of that. <laughs> then, um, Are you kidding me? But, um, what else was there? Um, yeah, and then he, he just has a flamethrower, pretty much. I mean... Is it Pyro? That may be the only respectable character out of that. Uh, that's the rogue guy, and he just has a gun where he just fucking shoots fire at shit, right? Yeah, he's a Pyro. Yeah. He tried to be to good. Wanna, some men just want to watch the world burn. And Mick Rory just wants to watch everything burn. Oh, and Golden Glider. I forgot about her. She's a Does Captain... Does she have a Golden Glider? No, she's Captain Cold's little sister, Lisa Smart. She became super villain after the Flash killed the top. Oh. So the top was important to her, huh? Because he, yeah, uh, she was... he spins around and gets smarter. No, because he was her boyfriend. Her lover. And the Flash Ooh. killed him. Oh, what happened to his atomic little uh, spinny top there? Uh, Flash stopped it. That was back in the Silver Age. Like I said... Most the the top existed during the Silver Age, and then he somehow came back from the dead and possessed uh, the Flash's dad's body and we killed him. Somehow it. came back from the. Didn't we have a discussion about this earlier? Anybody could come back from the dead at any point in time, and nobody gives a shit. Yeah. Nobody but, gives a <laughs> shit that anybody comes back from the dead. Well, yeah. Now that they have the White Lantern Corps, who, their power is pretty much bringing people back from the dead. <laughs> and I am running out of time on this thing.